Anxious and avoidant attachment styles, which one are you? Generally, in a couple, we're gonna have both those attachment styles pulling against each other. So when you're anxious, you've had experiences in your life that make you feel like love is gonna be taken away. That's generally from experiences that you've had, like with a girlfriend, uh, or past relationships, and sometimes it's from our original love models, so the people that gave us love growing up. And they used to withdraw love or take it away when we were bad or we didn't do the right thing. So it creates this need inside of us to be constantly reassured that the person that we're with loves us. Now, for us, that's great. And maybe your uh, love language is touch, so you're always going to want to be touched. Or if your love language is uh, gifts, then you're always going to want to receive gifts from your partner. But that puts a big burden on the other person. And generally, not all the time, but generally, they're going to have an avoidant style. So they grew up in an experience where love was taken away. And their best defense against that was to withdraw themselves from that source of love. So they went the opposite direction to the anxious style. Now in a relationship, what they're gonna do is, as that um, anxious person comes towards them and they can feel that neediness, that's gonna feel pretty revolting to them. So they're gonna withdraw, which of course is gonna create inside a relationship even more anxiety for the anxious attachment style person. So now they're gonna ramp up their neediness and the avoidant person is going to pull even further back. So if you want to break this cycle inside your relationship, what you need to be able to do is, if you're the avoidant style, you need to make a choice pretty much every day to lean in, to open yourself up to that love the other person wants to give you. And the way this will work is you might think, oh my God, this is going to encourage them and, and make them even more needy. In fact, based on the laws of human behavior, it will be the opposite because as they feel you staying steady and not pulling away, their anxiety, of course, decreases. So now they're not as anxious in the relationship and you won't feel that smothering that you would normally experience inside of it. So this is a great solution to those two types of attachments. Now, if you want to know more, if you want to do more work on this yourself, please reach out, DM us, contact us through the profile link, um, either on TikTok or on Instagram or on Facebook. Thanks for being here.